guys, what's up? It's Avita from Avita's Light Tarot. Please don't forget to hit that like button and support my channel. I greatly appreciate it. Also, if you want a personal read or have any questions, reach out. My information is in the description box. Okay? Also, if you feel the need or want to, uh, you guys can hit my tip jar up. It is in the donation box. Okay, guys? So, what I got here bank somebody's going to the bank hmm that was another read i was going to do but maybe that might be coming up in this okay so i got a message about travel okay divine father mother ancestors spirit guides and the most high please surround us and fold us and protect us with your light anyone setting any spell with evil or negative intentions towards us please send it back with full forgiveness thank you thank you archangel michael we please protect us Okay, so I was told to grab my dream cards, okay? These are like uh, stuff that may, like happens in your dream. I got this travel card. I noticed that it's got sunflowers. I've been noticing a lot of sunflowers lately. That could be somebody's favorite flower, okay? That could just be some a sign for you. Also, travel. You could be wanting to travel. Okay, maybe there's somewhere you want to go. Or you could be feeling the need to travel. Also, what I was picking up here, somebody lost somebody. And since then, you've been wanting to visit them in the spirit realm. And so, you've been praying for this, or maybe saying this out loud, um, like affirmations, to have this come about, like in your dream state. And you really want to visit this person in your dreams. Okay? And I feel like there what this card is saying is there's a guide with you that's bringing you there's a butterfly here which is a passed on loved one okay so the butterfly is with the guide and they are guiding you and not to lose hope is what i'm getting you're almost there just to keep going you got to stay focused and you got to be on a certain vibration to reach that level or a certain um amount of focus or something here there's something that you have to reach but I'm hearing you're almost there. It's like, do you see they could see the house um, in the back? They could see this house and, and they're looking, right? The guide is driving them to this house. The butterfly right here is the past on loved one. But it's in the distance. So you're not far from reaching this person that you really want to speak to. Okay? Also, you might be studying some stuff here. I have the card, like, doctor, like, study... Uh, getting information like the knowledge about maybe dreaming okay so you may be trying to figure out um, how to control yourself in your dream state maybe astro traveling all right these are things that you might be studying again with the birth chart i know i've been bringing this up every reading but there are things about the moon cycles that can help you in your dream state okay that's when you have more power more energy and that may help you also Okay, I'm being told to share this with you. This is a very beautiful message. All right, I have Logan. What did I have before Logan? Hold on. Pepper. All right, somebody's name might be Ed. I have um, Pepper. Could be somebody's name. Um, wings. You've gotten your wings, okay? The bank. And also, I got Logan. Somebody's name could be Logan, okay? But something about the bank is coming up here, too. Let's see. Let me get a quick angel card out. I really feel lately that your your loved ones are really reaching out to you guys. I, I want to make a set that is just for the spirit realm. I think I'm going to work on that. Um, I haven't found a set of cards that were just for the realm. But I mean, a lot of these we could kind of move, move it there as a, you know, to get the message. But I want something that is just from what they want to say. And so I'm working on, on a couple of things. Um, hopefully I can get it done 
within the next couple of months. It takes time, you know, to work on on your cards and make sure that they're right. I got a set done. I got two sets done, but I don't have, I can't get my printer to work correctly to print these stickers out that I need of the cards I made. So I wrote on them, but I love the cards that I made. I just need, if the stickers would have came out, I could put them on it and then I could actually get copies. Um, I will let you guys know when I use them though and you guys could tell me if you do like them. Okay. Also, if any of my members are on here, um, I, I keep forgetting to tell you guys, if you guys were the ones I mentioned the cards to, please email me, okay? Okay. I'll get another message out about it. Alright. You are confused or indecisive because you do not have enough information. Do research or seek expert advice before making a decision. Okay, so for somebody here there's a decision that you're indecisive about that might be a little confusing, okay? And they're saying to get more information before stepping ahead on whatever this is, okay? Also, remember that you are on a path. Take one step at a time to happiness. So you are on your path. All right, this could be um, a decision it can even be something simple, right, as to taking a certain vitamin, or it could be something bigger as to a certain job or something here. But it, they're saying to just get some more information on it. So you, you're probably very good at researching things and getting information. See what comes out scale keep life keep your life in balance okay so things could have been a little out of balance and things are starting to come together now and they're saying to keep this in balance right because once it gets a little chaotic it, it gets hard to get back into balance I feel that people are trying to do this around you I notice around the pole there's a snake. So the snake's probably trying to get out of out of balance here. I don't know if you notice the snake wrapped around, right? Dealing or a relationship with a woman. Dealings or a relationship with a woman. This person may be trying or maybe this is who you need to get more information about. Some a deal that you want to make with this person. Okay. Great passion. So you have great passion for something. This could be an, a job. Okay. And I have disappointment in some affair. So scissors cut. Maybe you're wanting to cut this person off because something doesn't seem right. Okay, get out. Wow. Huh. Up. Get out. Up. Get up. Aircraft. Okay. Get out. Get out is what really stood to me. Okay, get out. Um, somebody may be telling you to, or, you know, this could be something with a home or a business, something here. Advice from a friend. All right, someone could have told you you needed to get out or they could have made an offer to you here, not, oh, somebody is doing, they're doing some kind of not magic, okay? They're doing some kind of witchcraft here. And this is why spirit is telling you to cut them off. Because you started getting things into balance. You found your balance. And now this person is trying to not you. Like, 
make it so that you're stuck, okay? With something or someone or a situation, okay? And they're saying to cut that off. Cut this off, all right? Maybe you're going to get more information and find out that this isn't what you need. This could also be this friend, all right? This could be the friend that they're telling you to cut off, or this could be the woman. The woman could be the friend, okay? But there's somebody here that needs to be cut off. I feel that you'll know who this is. This person um, could try to try to get, they could get in your head a lot, somebody here. Reward for merit. And you've been rewarded. You've been recognized. And somebody doesn't like this. Okay. I feel like whoever this is that you want to reach out to in your dream state probably was always there with you. Farm. Okay. You could have you could have got raised on a farm or you could um, be buying a farm or you could be dreaming about a farm. All right. Something about a farm is coming up though. Um. What I get here, though, is you may always have reached out to this person who passed and they were always there when you needed good advice. And now they're not there. And you just, whenever you really need them, it's like you don't have them to lean on. I'm getting that song, Lean On Me. And so this is why you may want to visit them. This is one of the reasons besides, you know, you love them. Um... But you have somebody here that is lowering your vibration or trying to. Somebody that's stubborn, aggressive, okay? And I feel like you're just trying to stay focused and stay on your path near you. Somebody may be near you. Oh, this is, your loved one is near you right now, okay? Success. So... They're saying that you are going to be a success. You are a success, okay? Crown. Honor and respect will come to you. You got your crown. That's part of your reward. You got crowned. You should accept valid criticism. Somebody may criticize you a lot or... Um, make you feel a certain way and maybe you feel like you should have you should accept it okay or this is telling you maybe you're not good at doing that and you need to all right so take that as it resonates too much concern with sexual matters somebody here is got a sex addiction this person is so used to harness harnessing to harvesting people's energy by having a lot of sex. Rabbit is like a lot, okay? Um, yeah. I'm hearing wham bam, thank you, ma'am. Like this person, that's all, like this is what they do, and it's not just with one partner. And you gotta be very careful about who's, what is attached to somebody, okay? I noticed a big change when I went um, celibate, like when I stopped having that kind of relationship for the longest. It's been a long, long time, okay? March. Something about March is important. Okay, somebody's birthday, maybe March. Somebody here is being a little foxy, like a trickster, okay? But somebody may be very resourceful, especially when it comes to business deals, okay? And this person could be doing a, a deal with somebody that's a ways in a distance or trying to uh, do some kind of deal here when it comes to you, like... Um, I don't know what this is. If this is something that they're offering you or something that they're wanting to, okay? 
I just feel like somebody here is too much in your business. But your loved one is near you, okay? I heard the more that you practice on meditation and spending time in quiet in, in quietness, basically in nature, or even at home, but in quiet, that this will help you replace. This will help you hear them easier and more. You got to detach from your ego. Somebody's trying to replace you. Wow. So somebody wants to replace the you, the real you. That ain't gonna happen. Somebody mentioned on my comments that um, about a certain movie, uh, what is it? The Skeleton Key. Yeah. I was like, wow, I totally forgot about that. It was so old. I haven't watched it in a while. It does have some stuff on there now. The Thinking Man. So somebody is waiting on a deal to come through. Chill. <laughs> Just chill. That's what I heard. Just chill. Okay. So everything's going to be fine. They're just letting you know what's going on. They got this. Seven, seventh chakra, Archangel Uriel. So this is your crown chakra. You have gotten crowned. Now all you have to do is, so there's a gift. Something has been gifted to you with it, with your crown chakra, with your intuition. They're, they're saying you have some uh, upgrade, all right? You're getting a download or you've been getting downloads. Your ears could be ringing, okay? And um, some kind of knowledge. So you have access to the Akashic Records. Frequencies will also help you is what I'm hearing here. Yeah, and somebody sees you as... The gift now this person's looking at like a little star in their hand a glass star and it's like they have their eyes on you they see that you have gotten your wings and gotten your crown okay firmly Somebody may be um, very firm, aggressive around you. I just heard unapologetic. Who do they think they are? Who do you think you are? This big stuff. Somebody might be making potions. I don't know if you've seen the word prescription come up, and now I see this. Like, somebody could be making some kind of potions. I wasn't going to use this. Why did I pick up this deck? I guess since I picked them up, I'll use them. Self-sabotage. Somebody wants you to self-sabotage, but this person is doing it to their self. Okay. Sadness. This person um, May 2nd or March 5th, okay? That could be somebody's birthday or that date could be important. Um, somebody here is internally like just very off. They're sad, they're depressed, and they're trying to put this off on you. They could be saying that you caused something or it's your fault. They're trying to send you temptation. They tried to tempt you, okay? But I feel that this didn't work, all right? Wild. 
or remember past, present, future. But they're they were like being firm, like sending something like they're being very um, hard on on you and on people. This could even be somebody close to you. It could even be a boss. But somebody is very um, persistent. Okay wild you just want to roam and be wild and free like yourself right you don't want to have to be behind some kind of um what do you call it like door and like lock and key right you don't there should be no reason that people should be telling you what to do and how to do it also i notice her hands on the dragon head which it is the year of the dragon. So that might be, there might be something to do with this. Also, there could be a dragon tribe you may be a part of. I got family and tribe. Something about also 2020, okay? Alchemy. You're learning how to do this when it comes to good and bad, okay? Energy. You've had a lot of courage here. You let go of somebody because they didn't want to take off their mask. Aggression. This person has a lot of aggression. Somebody didn't want to take off their mask, so you let go of them. Okay? And do you see these people in the back? They're definitely doing, they're doing some kind of spell work, some kind of rituals. All right, they may have found out your ancestry link, something that you're linked to, a tribe here. I, I'm hearing a couple of tribes that you are connected to. Something about a dragon tribe, though, it's very significant with this one. It's probably why they wanted me to grab this. Also, an owl, something about an owl, okay? I have an owl in the background in this one card. You may be seeing owls lately that are very much standing out. Somebody could like ballet here, be very into ballet or just dancing in general. You took a leap of faith and you trusted, okay? Or oh, you're about to with this new beginning, but I feel that you have done this, okay? Maybe have to do it again. The devil. Yeah, so the devil's a liar is what I just heard in my head. The devil lied to you. So the devil may be trying to um, be sneaky. So they're, they're doing something. This, he may be trying to talk in your ear. Like uh, cause you to doubt or something. Okay, definitely cleanse your energy, but some somebody here is trying to attach something, right? With that knot, um, magic, or the, the, yeah, the witchcraft they were trying to do, and I feel like they wanted you to self-sabotage your new beginnings. Wow. They may know that you're trying to, I don't know if you said this to somebody, that you're trying to contact your loved one, that you're trying, you want to see them in your dream. Okay, I don't know if maybe you, somebody knew that this is something you wanted. Okay. If not, then I would definitely keep that to yourself. They want to get you, keep you at a certain level so you will not reach this point. Okay. You see how he's walking up the mountain? Like he took his leap of faith and he's going upwards now. Right? And, and then, of course, we have afterwards the devil. They're trying to attach something to you to weigh you down, to pull you down. And, um, Ten of Wands, so burdens. They want you to be burdened. Gabriel. Okay? Your name could be Gabriel, or you have the angel with you. I was, um, I was meditating earlier and I heard Gabriel. Okay, Gabrielle, Gabrielle, the high priestess. So you could be a high priestess or you know a secret. Okay, 
or somebody feels you know their secret. The hermit. Yeah, you, you are like a, a psychic investigator. You have been getting down to what is going on here, like to the nitty gritty of this whole thing that's going on with these people. I feel like you know, it's just that you don't have the proof to really prove it to somebody else, or maybe not all the proof you need. But I feel like you're very good at putting all this together. Okay. Or you've been doing a lot of soul searching, a lot of a lot of um, growing here. The chariot. Yeah, you're waiting on your chariot to come in so you can move forward. You could be um, waiting for something to come in for you. This could be like financially. Okay, maybe it's a, a job or a car or a home. There may be something that you're you're working on getting here. And that is where you're going to be able to just poof. That's it. You've accomplished whatever this is that you're going towards. I feel like that's that's all you're waiting on is that chariot. Yep, you definitely let go of whatever this distraction is and that is what's helping you, okay? Because somebody here wanted to sacrifice you. They wanted you to self-sabotage and sacrifice yourself. Whoop, there it is. Yep, this person wanted you to self-sacrifice yourself and it ain't happening. That's another reason that your your uh, your loved ones like with you the whole time. They're making sure none of this stuff gets to you. Okay. Compromise. Fifteen. Something about fifteen. Okay. Something could have happened when you were fifteen. Um. Compromise. You may end up compromising with the situation, or this is telling you to ask your angels or look more into the situation before compromising, okay? Listen to your intuition. Yes. Okay, if you ask a question, it's yes. Or with what I said, compromise, listen to your intuition. If this is something you want to do is compromise. Okay. Square something. You may want to square something off or somebody may be very square. Okay. Somebody's trying to waste your time. They're trying to drag your time out or delay you here. That's what I'm getting. This person is like uh, very negative, revengeful, narcissistic is really the word. Gambler. This person can have an addiction. Okay. You have, you've had to repair something a lot or restore. You could have somebody around you that drinks a lot. Um, that's abusive. Okay, you may be avoiding this person. Or this person, somebody could be avoiding you and they're drinking a lot. But I do have avoidance here. But there, somebody here is definitely abusive. And then um, I have somebody here that is a gambler and may even have an addiction. Okay, so we have a gambler. Somebody here who's drinking. And a repairman. So restart, you're restarting something or restoring something, okay? Maybe from all of this that's gone on around you or to you, okay? Maybe at one time you may have been the one that had the drinking problem and you um, got away from that. You repaired yourself, you restored yourself, okay? These could have been something from your past or somebody's past that's around you.
Yeah, so you could have like squared up. You could have fixed yourself up. Beautification. Okay. You could be a whole new person now. Boss-like. Okay, more of a leader. But there is somebody here that's trying to lead these other people in the wrong direction. You got this is what I'm hearing. You know what to do. Nature. Ground yourself. Find a sanctuary in nature and connect with the elements. Okay. This is also going to help you when it comes to visualizing and your meditation. Um, when you do meditation, especially if you're trying to try uh, to astro travel or go to the realms to visit your passed on loved one. Okay, that's another thing that can help you is nature. All right, guys, peace, love, and light.